Welcome to Darth Hawk Gaming. So, Ubisoft. Yes, Ubisoft, the, the company that says you don't own the games that you buy from them. Because they can just take it out of your library whenever they feel like it. And um, so, here's this person. Gaming editor. Yeah. Paul McNally has been around consoles and computers since his parents bought him a Mattel in television in 1980. Uh, having a physical game collection is becoming a thing of the past, and a top Ubisoft executive says it's something we're going to have to get used to. Much like we gave up our CD collections to Spotify and DV collections to Netflix. I don't have Netflix. Okay. Um, yeah, DVDs are still a thing. You can, they still sell uh, DVD players. Yeah, you, and they still sell. Uh, like it's very easy to get yourself a buy yourself an internal or external DVD drive for your computer. If that's what you want to do. Um, yeah. So, <clears throat> so yeah, we know that Ubisoft likes to take games out of your library just because you don't own them. You don't own them. And Ubisoft wants you to to spend money every month just to play a library of games. They have. Um, yeah, because you don't own them. You don't own them. You pay money, but you don't own them. So what is the winning move with Ubisoft? I'll tell you. It's very easy. It's very easy. The winning move with Ubisoft, the only winning move is not to play. Yep. The only If you're going to deal with a company that says, hey, you know, when you spend money on this, you don't own it. And we do, and we can take it out of your library anytime. And then all your progress is gone. All your progress is gone. Hmm. So it would have been better never to play in the first place, right? You know, spend all that, t spend that money on something which Ubisoft says you don't own. Spend all that time gaining achievements, you know, maybe playing with your friends. And then one day, try to play a game with your friends. And, oh, Ubisoft took it out of all of your libraries because you never owned it anyway, as far as they're concerned. Um, yeah, so the only winning move is not to play any games made by Ubisoft. Which should change its name to Ubisuck. Because that's more accurate. Uh, now this screen you're looking at right here is from an old movie. Okay. War Games. Uh, which, anyway, it's an interesting movie. Uh, a computer uh, goes off on exploring how to, you know, how to win a nuclear war. And comes up with the idea. The AI in this movie comes up with the idea that the only way to win a nuclear war is to never get in a nuclear war. The only way to win is not to play the nuclear war game. So, yeah, same thing. Only way to win when you're dealing with Ubisoft, don't ever play their games. Don't ever do it. Because if you don't play your, if you don't play their games, you don't spend money on it. They can't take it away from you later on. They can't steal it from you. They can't make it so you can't play it with your friends anymore because you never bought it in the first place. And then you win. Thanks for watching this video. Have a good day.